heading throughout Saturday afternoon. The clouds, they are going to be pushed to the side this afternoon. So we're going to be climbing to about 80 degrees for our high. As we head into Saturday night, Sunday morning, I don't expect us to run into any showers. If anything, we'll start to see some clouds build in, but those will push out once again for the start of your Sunday. Great windows open weather by Sunday morning. Temperatures are going to be in the low 50s for most of us, so the humidity is also going to be dropping as well. And then Sunday, slightly cooler. We will be in the low 70s for our highs as opposed to near 80 today but even more sunshine and that trend just continues. High pressure sets in and it is really driving the forecast for the next several days. And then as you're back to work on Monday, low 50s, upper 40s for a few of you. And by the afternoon, we are jumping right back towards that 80 degree mark. So as for your Saturday morning, how can you plan? Well, it's partly sunny right now, but it's going to become mostly sunny by the afternoon, I expect. Temperatures are going to be in the mid and upper 60s for a good chunk of the morning and quickly climbing. Your biggest trouble is really going to be the humidity and the pollen. It was dry for the most part yesterday, so those pollen levels are climbing a little bit not tracking any rain or storms. Here's a peek at the next seven days for you. Dry skies all the way through Tuesday. Temperatures dipping into the low 70s tomorrow, but then quickly climbing to near 80 on Monday, 90 on Tuesday. So make sure that air conditioner is working. If not, jump in the pool out back. As for Wednesday through Friday, I showed you, we're going to see that extra tropical low, or that, uh, yeah, extra tropical low system push through the Midwest. It's going to bring us the chance for some rain and storms Wednesday and Thursday, tapering off by Friday, but temperatures are also going to turn slightly cooler. We'll be back in the mid 70s, but then there's more.